state. And so he was like, how many, you know, how many pills did you put in there? And he was like, about 40. He was like, it was a whole bottle. And he was like, I'm so sorry. He's like, is she okay? Like he got tears in his eyes because he never wanted to hurt her, you know. And Jace is like, you didn't want to hurt her. Do you not know what that would have done to her? If she would have found you dead or, or if you would have died. And do you know what that would have done to her? Like, you got to stop being selfish. He's like, you need to get yourself together. You know, like you need to go to rehab or jail, whatever you need to do. He's like, you're going to pay for what you did. Okay. He's like, but I will help you at least get you an attorney or something, you know, so maybe you won't get as much time and maybe they can get you into a rehab program. He said, but you need to get your life together. <laughs> and so he was like, I will, you know, I'll do it, you know, because I don't know, I guess it gave him a, a renewed sense of life being that he almost took hers out. So Bethany comes to, and cause she was telling, she's like, I didn't do any, I didn't take anything. I didn't take anything. And so then she like, all, is she remembered she was in the room with Jack and she just couldn't, she was like, he did this to me. And he told him, you know, and that was a prime opportunity for Jace to tell her, yeah, he did this and make sure he was cut out of her life forever. <laughs> but he was like, he did it, but he, he meant to kill himself. He gave you the wrong hot chocolate. And she just felt awful. And she was like, you know what? But I can't keep saving him. <laughs> she said he got the want it for herself. And that was a great turning point for her. And it was nice that everyone showed up. You know, Gabe and Ash were already out there. And then Mia came, you know. And um, she when she finally, finally came to, because she was out for a good 24 hours. So when she finally came to, of course, she's hungry. And Ash was like, I'll go out. I'll get everyone some food. And so he does that. And, um, and they have just a good time. So it, it was, it was, it was a nice, um, way, I guess we wake up from such a freaking torment of, you know, damn near dying from an overdose that you didn't even try and do. And so, um, he throws her a birthday party. Of course, you know, he's going to find out her birthday and she never had one. And so he had a big cake and everything. And then of course he asked her to marry him and um it was super sweet and it ended great and so that was bethany and jace's story now we have our last book which is burn and that one's going to be about ash so that one should be fun and a little secret i haven't read that one yet so this one will be fresh when i do read it <laughs> um but uh let me know what you guys think uh in the comment section in the discussion notes wherever just let me know what you think um make sure you like and subscribe um if again if you want to get caught up on all of our other book reviews here on this channel um i'll put that link down in, below as well and as always thank you so much for tuning in to the always reading book club